U.S. Senator Norm Coleman was in Sauk Center Friday at St. Michael's Hospital discussing issues with rural health care and critical access hospitals. Let's listen to what he had to say. Uh, my name is Del Christensen. I'm the administrator of St. Michael's Hospital, and Senator Coleman will be coming here today um, to discuss uh, his rural health care initiatives. Yesterday in the Senate, he announced uh, seven different bills that will positively impact rural health care in Minnesota and across the nation. A couple of proposals that he has in particular would be to, uh, that would affect St. Michael's, would be one for health information technology. There, his proposal would be to um, establish some grant funds for rural hospitals to try to fund information technology, up technology upgrades. And the second one that's important to us would be the critical access reimbursement enhancement. St. Michael's is a critical access hospital, and one of the things that he has in, in one of the bills is to make sure that we get adequate reimbursement of 101% of cost for all services that we provide to Medicare Advantage plans. Medicare Advantage plans are a little different than straight Medicare, and right now they don't always pay us what our costs are. Access to quality health care, have medical health, medical insurance, and certainly have catastrophic insurance. How we get there is going to be a great debate. A great debate. And that debate is not going to be resolved this year or next. And we do things like uh, me uh, medical savings accounts, and we do things like look push to medical records, a great debate. But while we're having the debate, there are a series of things that we can do. There, there, there are a number of steps that we can take today to work with the folks. They need to have a good job, they have a good education, they need quality health care. And the quality of your health care shouldn't be dependent upon your zip code. You deserve quality health care everywhere. That's what critical access hospitals deliver. One in five people live in rural communities, but only one in ten physicians mm -hmm. practice in rural communities. We can make a difference. I think these proposals will make a difference. My name is Mike Flicker. I'm the administrator at Lakeview Medical Clinic here in Sauk Center. Uh, glad to see Senator Coleman come today and discuss his proposed legislation. Two of the key pieces of this uh, are very important to Sauk Center residents. One revolves around access to dollars for new technologies. As different communities look at all the different uh, potential for having electronic medical records and different ways of connecting, there's dollars available in this legislation for those types of activities. And the second one is more of a community need. Uh, there's dollars available for mental health initiatives, particularly for younger children under 18. And that's a need that as families and community members, it's just very nice to have access to.